Growing Cannabis in a Greenhouse, the best of both worlds. For one reason or another, growing cannabis plant indoors isn't feasible. This can be due to the presence of a flatmate who's in the police force or you still live with your not-so-broad-minded parents. Finding a plot of land that is private and secluded can also be a problem. So, what's the solution? What about a greenhouse, ideally one with opaque polycarbonate panels or whitewashed glass to keep out prying eyes? Of course, people might be curious to know what's behind the opaque glass, so it might pay to leave a small area with the glass clear and crowd that area with tomato plants to hide what's lurking behind them. Greenhouses are great and it is surprising how many people don't consider using one even when they have a free choice where to grow their plants. For a start, easily regulated temperatures help to create stronger, healthier plants that yield much more than outdoor plants. You can easily heat a greenhouse during a cold spell. The walls of your greenhouse are great for creating a humid environment, while there is always plenty of natural daylight so you can grow all year round. Polycarbonate greenhouses aren't expensive, and hand watering saves on expensive watering setups. So, what are the best plants to grow? That's easy. Go for auto flowering seeds that will produce a full crop irrespective of hours of daylight. Feminized seeds are also a great choice, but bear in mind that these plants require a regular 12 hours of daylight a day. As for germinating your seeds and establishing your seedlings, this is still best done indoors and then gradually introduce the seedlings into the cooler outdoor environment. Spring is a great time to do this. Move the seedlings into the greenhouse for a couple of hours a day, then increase that period over time until you can plant them out. Employ simple tricks like temperature-controlled skylights and a solar-powered fan to increase airflow and reduce chances of mold. Blocking light out is easy with black film to force flower your plants too. Finally, you have the option of a sea of green where you can grow lots of plants that have lower yields or just a few plants that have maximum yields. Greenhouses are great for taking your growing away from the home but still getting great yields. If you have any ideas of your own or you have any topics you'd like us to cover in the future, by all means, leave your ideas in the comment section below. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe so you too can become a cannabis expert.